Todas las veo buenas y me borrón la blanquita y la morena. Let's talk about how strong Deku is. This video will contain manga spoilers for My Hero Academia. Now, ever since I started posting more My Hero Academia related content, a lot of people have been asking how strong is Deku now. If you're not caught up to the manga, then there is a lot to go into here. First things first, Deku can move at 100% without sustaining any damage. Meaning he's already superior to the All Might in the beginning of the series. And keep in mind, this is the same All Might that was able to go toe to toe with All for One. On top of one for all, Deku has quirks such as Black Whip, Float, Danger Sense, Smoke Screen, and Fajin, which is a completely broken quirk. Deku gets a tremendous boost in speed and strength from this quirk. So imagine how powerful this is from the already enhanced speed and strength Deku gets from one for all. Deku was even able to go toe to toe with Shigaraki in the war arc. The same Shigaraki who was easily able to beat Endeavor, the number one hero. 
After the war, Deku was able to one-shot Muscular, the same Muscular who nearly killed him in their first fight. To make it a bit easier to understand how strong Deku is, now let's compare him to his classmates. In chapter 320, we see class 1A go up against Deku, a Deku that is barely able to stand, mind you. And this entire fight, Deku was on the defensive and was not attacking at all. Yet he was still overpowering everyone in his class. And they even state he's gotten too strong. Think about this, he was overpowering his entire class, and he wasn't even fighting. And to make it even more impressive, Deku is heavily weakened here. He hasn't slept or ate in days, and he can barely stand. Deku is just too strong for his own verse.